It's almost too much to fathom. You're in a deep sleep when all of a sudden you are startled awake by a loud noise. It's around 4, I want to say 4, 4.15. All of a sudden we hear it sound like a cat fight almost. At first, Bonnie Moriarty just thought it was her cat and dog getting into a scuffle. I woke up and a cat and the coyote came running into my room. <laughs> it's still dark. Bonnie says she can hardly believe her eyes, so she grabbed a nearby golf club for protection. Well, my husband was out of town, and so my poor kids are upstairs, and I'm screaming. Bonnie thinks the coyote most likely came from this wooded area back here. At one point, she says her miniature schnauzer came running in, barking up a storm. But the coyote just crouched down in the corner and remained timid. And that's when I realized, holy crow, I've got a coyote stuck in my bedroom. By that time, she says her kids were wide awake, and so she called the Bixby Police Department. Well, we shut the bedroom door, and they came with, I'm sure there's a term for it, but a, on a stick with a little loop. So I had three policemen in my bedroom trying to get the coyote out. Using the catcher poles, two of the officers were able to get the loops around the coyote's neck and carefully pull it outside and release it safely back into the woods. Bonnie believes the coyote may have gotten through her back door after it saw her cat. He somehow just lunged at the door and the door opened.